And new details tonight about a shocking trail of violence, a family tragedy that police are calling a horrific double murder suicide. A mother and father are dead, along with an eight month old baby who was tossed out of a car on the freeway. Another child survived. That surviving child reportedly told investigators that her mother pushed her and her baby sister out of a moving car on the 405 early yesterday morning. That mother then died after slamming into a tree a short time later, and it all started with a brutal murder in Woodland Hills. KTLA's Carlos Salcedo joins us live from Woodland Hills, where the family lived and where the terrifying violence all began. Carlos. Ladies, detectives have pieced together the gruesome details of exactly what happened. A family of four torn apart. The suspect, a mother who investigators say took her own life. Tonight, a motive remains a mystery. A disturbing chain of events painting a dark picture. The initial crime scene, the family's Woodland Hills apartment, where neighbors say they heard a loud disturbance early Monday morning. My daughter heard it around 3.30 or 3.40 in the morning. She woke up briefly uh, by screaming, I guess, and um, then she fell back asleep because the noise only went on for about a minute. Richard Berglund lives next door, but it wasn't until hours later that he made a gruesome discovery. The, their front door was wide open. It was like propped open. I saw pretty much it was in disarray. And then I saw a pair of legs uh, sticking out from the kitchen area. The victim identified as 29 year old Jalen Cheney, who was an Air Force mechanic. LAPD confirming his partner, 34 year old Danielle Johnson, stabbed him during a heated argument then took off with her two kids, pushing them from a moving car on the 405. Their eight-month-old baby killed. The nine-year-old daughter injured but survived. Detectives say Johnson continued driving, going over 100 miles an hour before intentionally crashing her Porsche SUV into a tree on PCH in Rodondo Beach. I looked at my phone and I saw that there was two kids found on the side of the 405 freeway and their ages, and I screamed. The news of the twisted incident hard to stomach for those who knew the family. A motive is unclear. According to Jalen's brother, he was an aspiring meteorologist, telling KTLA he didn't know the details of the couple's relationship, but was a great father. Knowing that that poor child saw what she had to see and experienced what she had to experience on the side of the freeway and, you know, losing her mother the way she's now lost her mother and probably the last memory she have of her mother is not going to be great. And uh, I, I just can't. That, that is going to haunt me forever. And from start to finish, this double murder suicide happened within two hours. Detectives able to connect the dots late yesterday. We're live tonight in Woodland Hills. Carlos Salcedo, KTLA 5 News. All right, Carlos, thank you.